you need to close some of these windows. Uh, we have a couple things that we're doing today. First off, we're going to be doing the review of my six example box flavors. Woo! Uh, and then we're doing episode three of Life is Strange, The Reckoning of Time Kitten. And I think that's it. Because me and Nicole are going to watch Mad Max together. We're going to hang out uh, and just kind of take the day. Uh, the next two weeks, it's still up in the air, but I may be streaming over at my dad's. Uh, just trying to get my bills situated, so I might just pack up my setup and some clothes for work, get a couple t-shirts and my shorts, and go to my dad's for like two weeks and hang out. And then on weekends, I'll be taking them off to hang out with Nicole. Uh, so there's that update. Still kind of working on the details, so tomorrow, if I go live and I'm at my dad's, that's what's going on. Um, but yeah. Okay, autofocus isn't on. Perfect. But yeah, that's the plan. Um, also, we have two emotes. We have Rob What and Rob PR. Use those in chat if you have better Twitch TV. Fun stuff. All right, so let's uh, let's uh, get this started. So if you guys don't know what Zamplebox is, it is a subscription-based vape juice program where you pay 20 bucks a month, 25 bucks a month, or 45 dollars a month, and you get e-juice in the mail uh, as that kind of feature flavor profile helps you discover new flavors, different companies, yada yada yada. Comes with a nifty little menu. Tells you what the names are, what company produces them, the size of the bottle, nicotine content, VG content, and uh, what flavors make up that mix, if it is a mix. Uh, so we're just going to get this started. Uh, we're gonna, just going to go right down the list. I'll review each one and then I'll just uh, say my top three. So the first one on the list was Apple All Day. Uh, let me find the bottle here. That's not it. That's not it. There it is. Apple All Day by Victory Liquid. Um... It's supposed to be a crisp green apple. Crisp green apple. Um, I was actually really looking forward to this flavor when uh, they said it was uh, coming in my box because I'm a big, big fan of green apple. Like, my Franken juice green apple is almost gone and I'm sad about it. This is my favorite green apple ever. But, so when this came in, I was really looking forward to it. I was like, green apple, I love it, it's gonna be good. It tasted to me more like an apple cider, um, so I maybe smoked like half the tank, and then I just kind of like, I was kind of over it, unfortunately. I was expecting a lot better, but it was still a decent flavor. Uh, I think it's one of those flavors where I would more uh, smoke it at like a limited type of thing, like maybe with like an RDA, like do, a, do a one thing of dripping it, smoke it, and then that's it for a while. Um, the next one we had was Checkered Flag, also by Victory Liquid. This was the first one by Victory Liquid that I tried, and it's so fucking good. It is blueberry and nectarine bubblegum. I smoked this, it tastes like motherfucking candy, and I love it. This is easily one of the top in the box. It tastes great, it smokes great. Um, I smoked this one before the apple all day, so this one kind of set like a high bar for apple all day to hit. And Apple All Day just didn't hit it, as I said earlier. But, great fucking flavor. Victory Liquid, Victory Liquid Checkered Flag, Tier 1. Tier fucking 1. Loved it. Um, the next one on the menu is Fruition by Seduce Juice, based out of Charlotte, North Carolina. Um, it's supposed to be Fruit Loops, Cereal, and Milk. Again, this was the first flavor, I think, that I tried, and it was fucking phenomenal. It is a great flavor. It tastes just like Fruit Loops. Um, I was very content with it. I liked it a lot, but like after smoking like a fourth to half of the the uh, the tank in my uh, sub box mini, the way I described it to like Nicole and uh, my dad when we were talking about it, it, it's kind of like imagine you're living on your own for the first time, 
You're not really sure how it works. You don't know what your bills are going to. You don't know where your money's going. So you're very limited on food. So you buy one brand of cereal and you buy ramen. And that's all you're eating for months. It gets old. You know what I mean? It gets old. The taste gets kind of bland. Well, not bland, but it's kind of just like, meh. It's not what it was when you when you were like, oh, this is my favorite cereal. Om nom 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 nom. It's kind of more like, all right, I'll eat this, but it's good, but you know. So again, it's a great flavor, great, great, great flavor, but it's another one of those flavors where I would probably only do it in RDA, just so I could smoke it for a little bit and then be done with it. Um, the next one is Karma, which is peaches and cream uh, by Gypsy Juice, which I'm smoking right now. It's a great flavor. It's a great, great flavor. Smokes really well. Tastes really good. Um... So yeah, just overall good flavor. Um, kind of got a little bit of advantage because when I smoked it, I had just replaced my coil. But, you know, it's whatever. Still a good flavor. Uh, the next one is Leprechaun Smack, which is supposed to be a creamy mint milkshake. Uh, it was a good flavor. Uh, it tastes really good. Or it tastes pretty good. I wouldn't really say really, really good. But it's pretty, it tastes pretty good. It's, a, again, it tastes good, but it's one of those flavors that I would only smoke it in RDA, where I can smoke it for like 20-30 minutes and then be done with it for a while, uh, but still a good flavor. Uh, unfortunately, I don't have an RDA, so it's definitely something I need to look into eventually. Nick, I'm looking at you. Um, and the last one we have is PMF, which is peach and mint. So I got two peach flavors in this one, the PMF and the Karma. And the first one I smoked was the PMF, and the thing that kind of like made me worried is I haven't always been the biggest fan of peach. So when I was at work and I was refilling my tank with the PMF, I kind of got nervous a little bit. I was like, am I going to like this? It, like, what is this going to taste like? I'm not a big fan of, um, of peach, so I don't know how this is going to go. And so I dropped it in, let it sit, uh, went outside, did my thing, and it tastes like motherfucking... Um, uh, peach rings. Peach rings. It tastes just like peach rings, and it's fucking just phenomenal, and I love it. Again, like, all the flavors in here, they smoked really well. Um, none of them were terrible. I'll say that. None of them were terrible. Some of them just didn't meet the bar that I wanted them to meet. Does that make sense? Like, um... Uh, Apple all day. I was really, I was really hoping it would be better than it was, but still, it was a good flavor. All the flavors are good. It's just some of them just didn't hit my bar, or some of them I just don't have the equipment I would like for them. Essentially, is what that is. Uh, so as for ranking, uh, usually uh, they send like a little card with first, second, and third place. Uh, they didn't this time, unfortunately. So yeah. I didn't get that, so I won't be able to do that. So I'm just going to tell you my top three, and that's where we're going to leave it. Um, number one is easily, easily, 1,000% checkered flag. The blueberry and nectarine bubblegum. This is actually one of me, uh, this is what I'm going to be putting in my vape next um, to smoke it again. It's great. It tastes like candy. Uh, smokes really well. It doesn't get old. doesn't get boring. At least not yet. Um, easily probably my most enjoyable smoke from the box this month. Uh, tier fucking one flavor. Um, yeah, easily victory liquid, checkered flag, blueberry, and nectarine bubblegum. Um, and it's 75% VG, but it, it pounded me with flavor. Like, even with being that high VG. And, um, I don't really know what else to really say about it. Like, me and Nicole, when we tried it, uh, we both agreed that it tastes like candy, but we can't quite determine what it is to me it kind of tastes like a blue baby bottle uh, baby bottle pop or like a blue airhead um it's very very good very very good uh second <sighs> i'm actually debating second still i know what my third is but i don't know what my second is that's the issue because second both of these flavors were very, very good smoking on their own and just able to enjoy all day on their own. But I can't justify putting two peach flavors in the top three. I can't say, oh, here's blueberry, nectarine, bubblegum, and then here's peach and mint, and then here's peach and cream, or vice versa. I just, I can't bring myself to do that. Um, 
Because I know Nicole liked the Karma more, the peach and cream. This was hers. This was like her bread and, bu bread and butter from the box. She really enjoyed this one. Um, but for me, my second place has got to go to Source Code. PMF. Peach and mint. It was great. I enjoyed it a lot. Uh, great flavor. Great smoke. Tasted like peach rings. I love peach rings. So yeah. Number two goes to Source Code. Tier one. Um... Yeah. And then third place... Third place is going to Seduce Juice's Fruition. Even though I couldn't smoke this constantly throughout the day, it is still an amazing flavor. Um, just... It tastes just like Fruit Loops. I thoroughly enjoyed it. Um, it was the first flavor I smoked out of the box. And it set the bar high. It set the, bu the bar high for the entire box. And... I can gladly say that four out of the six bottles I received hit that bar that I wanted them to hit. Uh, the only two that really didn't do it for me were Apple All Day and Leprechaun Smack. Uh, and Leprechaun, both of them kind of disappoint me that they didn't hit the bar just because A, I'm a big fan of Green Apple, so I expected a lot more from Apple All Day, and I'm a big fan of Mints, so I was really, really hoping that Leprechaun Smack was uh, more, uh, more of a hitter. So yeah. Victory Liquids, uh, Checkered Flag, Source Codes, um, PMF, and uh, Fruition uh, by Seduce Juice. Top three right there. Thousand percent. Don't try to change my mind. It's great. They're great flavors. So with that being said, if you guys want to try out Sample Box um, with these programs, uh, they have three different levels of membership. There is Silver which is twenty dollars a month and you get three bottles a month uh you pay 25 which is the one that i'm on right now you get six bottles a month and then if you pay, go the big way and you go platinum and you go hard in the paint and you pay that 45 dollars a month 11 bottles are coming to your door every month um if you guys want to try it use my link down below you just click the image for sample box It'll take you to my tracking link. That helps me a lot. And then if you want 10% off your purchase, use the code FRIENDOFZB, all one word. That'll get you 10% off. It's a great program. I like it. Uh, I think my dad is thinking about trying it. I've heard a couple of viewers um, express interest in it. And yeah, it's great.